Hi guys, I'm coming live to you from the Spalon here in Oklahoma. We're going to come in and talk with Bree and Tiffany. She has a 5,000 square foot location. This is a beautiful salon. I mean, you're going to be floored. So come in. You guys can ask plenty of questions, but let's come in and let's chat with them. Tiffany. Hi. And that's Bree. Hi. <laughs> so, um, Tiffany is the owner. So she's going to take us on this beautiful tour. So you can see her entrance right here is just flawless. And she has window side, which for me is just, I'm mesmerized just by the windows. <laughs> but um, no questions, right, babe? You're just going to no, yell them out? Well, we just got hearts so far. Oh, you got hearts. Ooh, oh, hearts. Okay. Oh, hearts. We've got a lot of people on. A little slower, baby. You don't want to get people all sick. There we go. All right. <laughs> you know, you got to direct. I got you my directions in the back. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so Tiff, this is your retail, retail area. Yes. Here at the Spalon, we offer an array of wellness, skincare, um, body products to help maximize results here at the Body Art Spalon with the services that we offer. And so all the services that you do. She does a lot of services. So. Yes. Is it too far away, baby? No, nope. okay. I got so you. So tell us all the services you offer here. We offer a rate of uh, body wraps, which mainly are mineral body wraps with um, LA Slim Wrap. So it's an inch loss, no dehydration, and it's no water loss. We also offer infrared treatments, uh, body sculpting, eye lipo, uh, thermoscope using cavitation and RF, uh, corrective skin care. Um, so we do chemical peels, microdermabrasion, so forth, every all the correction, and as well as massage and body waxing, and soon to come sugaring. Yep. <laughs> do you do laser hair removal? Is the question. No, we don't believe in that here. And what's the website? The website is uh, bodywrapspalon.com. You can also check us out on Facebook and Instagram. So we're gonna go on the tour. You guys be ready. I mean, I just did the tour, so we're redoing this over again. But it's an amazing location. Amazing. And you know, I don't bring halfway stuff. <laughs> so, okay, so well, we're come, going. Now you're entering the Spalon experience. So this is, you're taking the tour. <laughs> so we do have a professional makeup room here. Uh, we offer professional I makeup. Love that. Love that. I love this right here. Like this is, I'm a mirror girl. Your, my husband yes. can tell you I love we mirrors. We love mirrors here. We have lots of those. And you have an O-ring. Oh, yes. yes. Which takes great pictures. Yeah, it does. So I'm going to take some We have photo shoots. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. We could definitely do mm -hmm. that. So we offer just um, lessons as well as oh, if, you do. Yeah. Or if you have an event. So it's always so great when I do speaking engagements. So uh, I can come in here and get my makeup done. Absolutely. Professionally. So it works out this great. This is so cute. See, see, y'all good decorating people. Y'all are good. <laughs> I don't decorate, but you know, you can pay people for that. Okay. Yes. Next, we have our. And uh, where's your location? That's the first question. It's uh, Oklahoma City, 6813 North May. We're in the central area of Oklahoma City, so you can get to us from anywhere. And uh, from anywhere in Oklahoma City, it's 20 minutes from each direction. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah, okay. We have our body sculpting room where we do, um, like I said, we do thermoscope. And that's our name. We call it thermos thermoscope. Oh, you call it thermoscope. Yes, but we do cavitation RF. Um, reason being because most locations offer just cavitation separately and RF, but we actually incorporate the bio. And RF the, is radio frequency. Yes. Okay. Uh, tri frequency. Um, the vacuum part of it. So we do all, all of those in one session. So it's kind of, you're getting more, they lower the price in some areas just so that they can offer just one or the other, but you add it up, it's the same. We what do. was that ring light in the makeup room? That was the, uh, um, it's the, it, I call it the O-ring, but o -ring. It's, the, it's it helps to give a clear, uh, a clear picture. Tell them I'll take one, they can see the selfies on my Facebook page, I'll take some selfies. It's, a, it. it's a bright light. It is a bright a light. Good image. Mm -hmm. A lot of the um, uh, photo shoots, when you go, yeah. when you see makeup, or uh, you see um, lighting. Yeah. What is it when the models have like clear? Typically, their hair is back, yes. and it's a black back. That's the O-ring that's in front that they take yeah. the pictures over. It gives a very clear. Yeah, y'all see. I'll do some selfies. Well, if you do, where the, can we buy one? 
online, online Amazon yeah. is a great place to buy yeah. it. Uh, eBay. eBay. Yeah. Yeah. Me? What? I gotta be a little bit closer, closer together. together. Oh, okay. oh, okay. All right. So we're now in our relaxation room. Is area where we bring our guests in. They can sit back and this is have tea. absolutely gorgeous. Again, Relax. love the mirror. And it's very co-ed, so if you see the colors, it's um, it's a great place for husband and wife. Yes. Uh, mother, daughter, daughter, mother. If they bring and it I in, like want to feel use cool. This Tiffany to separate so that there's a walkway behind and yes. we kind of make this in. Yes, because people are walking through with robes on, so it still oh, kind of makes it private. Okay. Um, where it's not kind of open, it kind of divides, but still still makes it comfortable okay. for the guests. Oh, I I'm loving this. You know. This is just beautiful. Okay, so you have the, uh, what? I, I, we have our body treatment rooms. And all of them on this side is actually body treatment rooms. We actually do infrared treatments in here. So they're the far infrared blankets. So we do several different services in these blankets. But we have two of okay. those. Okay, can you turn on the light then? It is on, baby. Oh, it's going to take a minute. Yeah. Yes. Can you explain the thermal as a question? The thermal the what? Thermal. Thermal. Th uh, Thermal, the thermoscope. Start okay, <laughs> it's um, it's cavitation RF, so it's uh, fat reduction. It helps to sculpt the body, and the guests will actually uh, it kind of bursts the fat, and it eliminates through your bowel and your urine. Oh. So it's about depending on the areas we do it do them as, in parts. Okay. So stomach, waist, thighs, arms, back, butt wow. lift. Yeah. And we also can do the face with the radio frequency. It also has bio. And not all states can do radio frequency because in California we're not allowed to um, do that. No, you guys are yeah, really restricted. Yeah, we are restricted, but here they can. Yeah, we we have certified techs that are, um, that are here. Uh, we've had trainers. We bring a trainer in every year for cavitation RF and bio training. I love your decorations and design. I'm telling you, Tiffany. You know, I may have to have you come up. You know. Cause I can't do that. Mm -mm. <laughs> I'm a good, I'm a good mirror girl. But like the rug and the room and the color, I would not pick it. Just, just me. Yeah. It's too, you know. But it looks good. So, now this one is the same, right? It's the same. These yeah. are both the same. These are very the same. So we're now. You had your makeup, body. So we're in room four. We're going to room five. Yes. Someone said it looks very inviting. Oh, thank you. Very inviting. Very inviting. And so this is the rooms that we love. These are our aesthetic rooms. This is gorgeous. And this is skincare uh, room one. We have two. And I like the fact that you actually put the bed all the way up here. I've never seen this before because most people would leave this open or they would go like this yes. and then cut down all of the space. Well, what we liked, what we've learned, um, I'm sure if there's estheticians that are listening, you have to worry about product missing and guests trying to find out what's going on. Yes. So this completely divides the room so the guests have plenty enough space for them to get comfortable, put their belongings down. We have our tray here that divides. So this separates the professional side and the guest side. I like that. So um, while the guest is laying here, we tend to clean, we tend to clean up and put products away while the um, SPS yes. is actually on there. So we clean up throughout. So by the time they get up and leave, it's already Everything nice is put clean. away. Yeah. I think that's mm -hmm. the thing with a lot of estheticians. We get so comfortable, and I've had clients still for me, mm -hmm. and I've caught a couple in that. Yeah. Um, yeah. But we don't realize the bed placement, where we're putting them, yes. and what they're looking at. Yes. And we want, we actually want it to look pretty, and that's fine, but you also have to... Uh, protect your your equipment. Yeah, you have to protect your product yeah. because I've like had that. little clients bring in those little sample bottles and they are trying to take some of the Ooh. cleansers, pump those, and when we tend to leave it out because we're doing our facial, we yes. leave everything out, but we, you know, people want to try stuff. What did she use? Oh, that felt good. Yeah, is, it, is this it? Let me try it. So I just make sure I put everything away. They don't really see exactly what I'm using unless I want them to know, and I usually have like a retail size and I say this is. The serum or SPF or lip balm. This is what I try. I put on you. We have it up front, but I try to separate the professional side between. That the is a side. cute towel warmer. Now, where yes. did that little thing? Where did you get that from? Amazon. I Amazon. Believe. We needed small ones because we, our larger ones we use in the massage or body suites, and we only need a few of them. I saw it. So. That's so cute. 
Because most towel warmers would take the whole spot. Yes. Yeah. And notice she had the little fan up there. You know, guys, I talk about fans, especially when we're waxing butts. People need, they yes. need to breathe. Yes. And when you have the steamer going, depending on the client. Some, some like it. Some yeah, don't. some people are in menopause. Yeah. So it just keeps the, the room circulating. I love that, yeah. Tiffany. And I didn't even notice that until I just came in there again. Yes. All right, I got to close up on the towel warmer one more time. Oh. Hold oh, on. Okay. <laughs> Okay, baby, that's enough for them. Don't right. They can watch it on the rewind. <laughs> okay, so show us your shakers before we go okay. to the next room. Here's our shakers. These are whole body vibration. Um, I, they're, they're shaker. It isolates. It oscillates oh, in, in vibration. Come closer to me. <laughs> and we have members that come in and actually get on these uh, throughout the week. We also use this to get the lymphatic system going before wraps or sculpting services. And then our member can take advantage of it when they are setting their goals. When they do come in and they do this in the sauna, it keeps them in the environment of wellness. So that way they can, it holds them accountable. So it's a great way to keep them on their, the path to what their goal is because they're constantly coming into the environment to where it's encouraged. And then you're always giving them education here, which I love this board, yes. by the way. So she's um, a, no fan of, of phones while they're in here, which is a good reminder for some of us. We don't really do this a lot. And then there's explanations here, product information, where they can go. So it's always coming back to business. Yeah. And most people will read it here because they're looking straight. Right. So you put it in their eyesight. Yeah? Yeah. yeah? yeah. Okay. Well, is, is this a membership establishment? We offer memberships both. I would not necessarily say we are a membership establishment, but we do offer it. It's been one of our staples here um, because it, they allow to get discounts and they're able to do it. I, if this is an esthetician asking, it's great residual revenue um, for the first and middle of the month. So we've done really well um, with that. So and I've been what do they pay monthly? Mm -hmm. We do an auto, auto, auto debit. Like in the mm -hmm. gym? Mm -hmm. um, the first and the 15th. And then, depending on what level they they get a certain amount of discount. Well, we'll talk about that. Do you we start talking about provide dermabrasion and microabrasion. Yep, we're going. Yes. We're going we to have go a this full second room. Yeah, Come we on. have full skincare. Yep. So this is room six. Yeah. <laughs> this is um, facial room. So two. all of your beds are up on the wall. Mm -hmm. Everything is the same for every room, which I love. Yeah. And then the big mirror and all that good stuff. And so the difference between the front room and this room is what exactly? You do micro, you have the machine. What is that machine up front? Our machines are on carts. So we can, oh. they're all, we can do anything we need to do in every room. Okay. If I need to do sculpting in this room because a guest is already here. Okay. We will do that. If we I need like to this. make this a massage room to do that, body scrub. If we need to pull up infrared blanket in here, we can. So most of our like machines are on carts. Being able right to there. do right here. You're not bending, twisting. I ain't running, right. I'm not. Nope, nope. It's you right You know, there. it is literally right, right here. There. I love this, Tiffany. Yeah. This is so nice. And everything is just here. Yep. Even from sitting down to be able to use this. Yes. This is so nice. Mm -hmm. You know, and this is actually a cupboard sink, right? So it yes. has all drawers and everything under here? Yes, it has drawers for our towels. So we just stock those. And then underneath, we have all our cleaning supplies to wipe down and clean. Wow. So we can do that while the guest is still laying there. We're putting up. And, and it's not clean even paying attention to me. I'm they're doing not, my exactly. own thing. They're not looking. They're, are, they're relaxing. So it's wow. behind me. So this was the galvanic machine? No, this is the... It has galvanic. This it's is a, the 6-in-1? 9-in-1. 9-in-1. This is the 9-in-1. The skin for life. With the steamer. Yes. Oh, this is skin for life? Mm -hmm. Okay. And again, the towel warmer, the UV towel warmer is by E-Mark. So it's the E-Mark UV towel warmer. I love this. I love... Have you had any problems with them at all? Not at all. These are so user friendly. Like two years I've had. Them. Wow, and you still have space. That's the problem with towel warmers. Yeah, yeah. they take up so much space. So much space. Okay, we're going to another skincare room. Well, this is a. Uh, oh, this is your massage. <laughs> How many towels do fit in this towel warmer? Um, I've probably got six in there. Depends on how many you're using, but it heats up really fast. So if you need to replenish, you can and heat. I like this sink too with the dark cabinets too, yes. and this is massage. Yes. And you guys don't do hot stone. You don't? Yes, we do oh, offer do. hot stone. Uh -huh, Somebody loves my wife's hair. Oh, uh -huh. thank you. 
This is so nice, Tiffany. I'm telling you, I'm just like, ooh-wee. This is beautiful. So here's all your storage. You don't want shows? No. You don't want I shows? I mean, well, it's, it's just She don't want storage overflow. storage. Yeah, it's, it's just the overflow. overflow. It's, is there um, aromatherapy? Yes. Question. Yep. Yes, we do offer. Um, in the massage, it's all therapeutic massage. So aromatherapy, hot stone, um, stretching. We like to call it integrative because it integrates um, energy, stretching, deep tissue, Swedish. So, is that it, baby? Mm -hmm. So we're this is side one, okay, guys. <laughs> we're gonna go to the other side of the spa. You're gonna be amazed, okay? Do we have a client bathroom we can look at? Oh, oh sure. yeah, right here. We have three. <laughs> they have three bathrooms. Oh, look at how beautiful! Oh my gosh, Tiffany! Oh my gosh! This is so nice. Wow, you see, now you do all this interior design stuff. I don't even know. <laughs> just make it comfortable for the guests. Well, the hell, this is way more than just comfortable. Wow, <laughs> this is so nice. But you don't have an info board in here, do you? No. Um, well, this right here, we actually just pulled them off because we're doing new uh, oh, promos. New promos. Yeah, we oh, changed okay. some of the colors on the promos and our and this our is brochure. So. Bathroom. This is a gorgeous bathroom. Everybody agrees. Yeah, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> This is nice, and it's right off of your, what do you call this service? Whole body vibration. Whole body vibration. Yes. So they can come in here and mm -hmm. just get themselves together, and they don't even have to live them. Oh, wow. Well, when, sometime when they come in, if they're going to do the sauna, they just come in, they go to the restroom. Where's the sauna? You, you didn't show me the sauna. Oh, okay. Let's you go to the other side. Come on, guys. We're going to go to the other side. So they they usually, what they'll do is they actually come in. Okay. And they go to the locker, put their stuff in, change their robe and slippers. They'll come out and get all that in the sauna. Oh, okay. Yeah. Did you show the cafe? This is the cafe area right here, which is very cute. And all. I know a lot of you guys were looking for um, different stuff. And uh, she has her cups and... This is so cute right here, and this is plug-in and, and water, but just the setup, and again, is this this is a dresser, or is this is a chair, what do they call this? Um, it's like a buffet table. Buffet table. Buffet, buffet, and then so we have all of our, supplies. we keep all our supplies okay. there. Tea, cinnamon. And I noticed that you're, you're um, green, so you're not doing a lot of plastic or paper. Yeah, yeah. She want, he wants us to come closer. <laughs> Yes. This is nice. I like this with the little cafe here, but this is again separated by this. Yes. So if the guest is finishing, they just want to take a break, they can actually sit down. I had this uh, reupholstery. This is an antique chair. Mm -hmm. um, it's like really it. nice. So they can sit here without, if they want to not want to sit over here. Options. Yes. Yeah, options. Okay, so let's go over to the other side. This is beautiful, Tiffany. I love it. I'm so big, I may have to come up here now and leave y'all. <laughs> Get away. Oh, here's the sauna. Here's the sauna. Oh. So it's a four person sauna. Four people. Wow. And so it's it's very relaxing. We wow. Have... Can we tell the, how many square feet again is this whole place? 5,000. Wow. Mm hmm. This is beautiful, I'm telling you. And then if they come out the sauna and they want to just take a rest, they can actually have a seat right here. It's still very quiet. So this is another sitting area, which mm -hmm. I love. And you have the lights down so that it's mm -hmm. inviting. Yes. You know, yeah. you're not blasted with. Eh. Right. Eh. Well, one of the goals here is for you to really take a step back and yeah. focus meditating. Even in the sauna. Might be jamming in here good too. Girl. Yeah, but it's nice jazz. jazz. It is jazz. Y'all yeah. be jamming. <laughs> but it's it just keeps the mood going. We're gonna and, go around this way, baby, and then come back out. Okay. And because we don't really consider ourselves a day spa. I don't. I wouldn't either. Yeah. I don't consider because most of our ladies, I want them to feel that they don't have to stay here all day. If they want to, they can. But they can take an hour to just release. And then go back out there. Mm -hmm. So it's one of those places that it's not like super quiet, 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 and you know you can't say this. You got to be here all day. It's not like that. And that, that's what they I love. Like that. that they come in for a thirty minute treatment, an hour, and get back out there, go exactly. back to work. Exactly. Yeah. Okay, baby, we're gonna come back here because the space keeps going. So I'm following you. <laughs> Alrighty. Now this is a multi-purpose room. This really. I love this um, room too. We do massages. It's kind of like our extra room. Uh, we we will do pretty much every service we can do in this room. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, so yours is where all your stuff is. Look, ooh, ooh, look at this one, I see. <laughs> so um, this table was lowered because we did a massage, but we do. This is beautiful. And again, the bed is facing yeah. here. Yeah. So some of you estheticians who are struggling with trying to figure out bed placement, to me, this is a lot more logical because then the focus is not on your stuff. And I never even thought about that. Yeah. But I like I like the whole setup. Sometimes I think we get caught up in the way the room looks when it's so pretty. From their point of view. Right. But not but functional. But you need to make sure it's functional and it's a way for you to uh, protect your products. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, people are curious. Yeah, they want, yeah. you know, we have camera phones. They like to take pictures. Where can I get this? They Google it. So you really want to separate that, you know, and you that. stay in your professional yeah, space. Space, and they stay in the guest space. Yeah. And it really just, from a liability standpoint. That's true. And, and you really have to think of it that way because yeah. it's inventory for you. Yeah. And, you know, so we have so many products in our rooms that we forget because we're not using it every day. And you look up, you're like, where is what that? Happened? Why is that go? gone? Right? So it really does allow, you know, okay, wait a minute, who was in here? Or you know that they would have had to literally leap over, go around. To get it I make it a little difficult. They would have to be very intentional with it. It won't just be an arm's reach. That's true. Yeah. That's true. Okay, guys, we're to keep going. Mm -hmm. Told you this is an amazing location. Amazing. And we have this, we have an extra bathroom once that we have, we have three. Bathroom. It used to be a treatment room, the city requires. So it's not really fancy or anything, it's, but it's here. Wow. This is huge. I love this big painting, too. Thank you. Mm -hmm. We wanted to turn it into a shower and, yes. you know, actually do that. We thought about a steam shower. Yeah. So I just hadn't, after we exp expanded we just hadn't really fully decided how we were going to show it. where all of the stuff behind the scenes you know i like to do behind the scenes so this is the room this is the prep this is room. where it all happens yes and i mean you have all kinds of stuff up in here yeah, we this is where our wraps are prepared um so what's in here what is this is warmers we actually these are bins those we are actually, food service warmers my well, yeah. god well most people if they somebody's on there that do body wraps you probably use a roaster Oh. We don't use a roaster, so if someone's using, oh. if they do, um, uh, was it peppermint seed twists or mud wraps or aloe wraps, if they do any of that, they probably use a roaster. That's generally what people but use. common. Yeah, okay. but we use these. We can control the um, temperature better, um, but we can actually get enough bandages for two wraps. We probably average, you know, 10 to 20 wraps a day, so wow. we need to be able to have... Um, the ability to, you know, to process that. So Here's these our are our wraps, our wrap roller, our sanitizer. We have our refrigerator. Oh, this is a wrap roller? What's a wrap roller? You want to see how it works? Yeah, show us. And what are you soaking Okay, in? Periscope, I'm going to show you how to roll bandages. Come on, wow. What do you soak them in? That's you the soak them in um, a proprietary blend of minerals. We don't use aloe or any of those other kind of stuff we actually use a mineral based wrap so basically you take this we wash them in a grapefruit grapefruit seed extract so it is organic okay so we don't use a detergent okay. but it still sanitizes um and it doesn't irritate the customer skin but you place it on here and it rolls the bandages whoa so i can do a basket of wraps in like 30 minutes, 100 to 200 wraps. Whoa! So most people probably do these by hand, but we don't. Oh, we don't have time. We do. Look, I'm still like, ooh, but that's a little toy. Yeah. So it rolls it. Wow. And what kind of wraps are those? These are um, a, uh, a style bandages. They run about uh, the ones we buy run about um, eight to nine. Well, depending on how you buy, how many you buy, but about seven to eight dollars a wrap. Um, there are other ones online. Do not buy them. They don't work. <laughs> and how many uses can you typically get out of one bandage? Like, if you take you... really good care of them, mm -hmm. um, we take really good care of our bandages because this is our money maker. Yep. Um, I mean, I've probably had these for two years. Wow. Yeah. So, but once the elastic is gone, but of course it's all about technique. But we do take really good care of our bandages. Question is if you get it from Universal. No. So these we, are the medical bandages that you yes, get. Yes, if you're doing real mineral body wraps, you're you the you, medical bandages. I mean, I don't know who's on Periscope, but this is a medical style wrap. It's not your typical just wrap you up, 
it is a technique to this. So oh. some of them may know already. I may have to come back and get one, y'all, and put it on put it on the space. Yes, you, you should. Know? I'm like, really? Well, oh, that'll be fun. Wow. Yeah. Wow. So, but we do guarantee six to twenty inches is not water loss. Um, like I was telling you earlier, yeah. one wrap it can help with the UTI. Yeah. Right here, but right. Yeah. You you it won't be there when you get it. Wow. So we keep all of our come here, baby. So overflow. We have all this side too. So this is There's all There's a question if you teach the rap. I can. Mm hmm I can. Now y'all know I don't associate with folks that don't do nothing now. Y'all know me. Okay. Yes. So we keep all of our overflow things here. I like that you give the staff space yes. to prep. Yes. Um because I want them to use a sanitary area. Absolutely. You know, we have our stuff to spray down, but from our thermoscope we use a conductor gel. We have um overflow here that we come in, fill them, spray them down. Um and this is a lot of prep products. space too. We uh huh and we actually break down products so we can feel so we can control the amount that we're using in the rooms. Amounts. Remember, we talked about amounts. Yes. You, you have a pseudotonic blanket. Uh, yes, actually, those the infrared blankets that we use are the pseudotonic. Um, I think I was probably the first, one of the first to bring the pseudotonic um, wrap here, and I love Sophia and Barbara over there. So, yes, I don't necessarily use their, I don't use the, the products, but the infrared because if you use far infrared, those blankets are the best. Okay. On the market, those two ninety nine blankets online. See, good information, guys. Don't buy it. Good information. It's a waste of money. Okay. People use them, but you don't get the same results in terms of burning calories. It's not the same. You want to show us your big industrial washer and dryers? Sure. Yes. Let's go look at. <laughs> so we're gonna look at the true back end, like you know the back end of Disneyland. How you have the back end? We're gonna go to the back end, back end. So. How long have you had these big babies right here? Two years. Wow, Tiffany. Two years. It was an investment, um, but we were going through uh, multiple of washers and dryers. Really? Because we the bandages, they can tend to break down. Oh. And then, because we have so many rooms, <clears throat> we, we'll be washing all day, 12 loads. This is a 50 pound dryer, 40 pound washer. So wow, we're able to. If you see how much laundry is in here, good luck. We're able to turn yeah. over faster. Um, now, also, it was energy saving. Absolutely, <clears throat> my, my water was cut in half. So who does all this staff? Mm -hmm. Everybody has a everybody, responsibility for Everybody laundry. pitches in. So if you see here, I was doing a vinegar wash yes. to get all the oils out of yes. our. So I've been doing that with the whites. And so this is all, I, I love all this. I'm telling you. break room. And the break room is behind Rudy. Go ahead and turn, baby. And it just gives them a chance to step away. Yeah. As far as far enough to step away. Wow. Well, come on. Let's go see the other side. We're still not on the other side yet. Come on. <laughs> so you do everything. You wash robes, the SD, um, is this the esthetician? Uh-huh. Check it. So you wash all of it here, and then it, this is rolling, so that you just roll it where you need to go. Well, no, um, it or can roll. It. But no, it just grab and go. But this is overflow. All of our rooms are equipped with robes and slippers and towels. Oh. This is just once we, you know, go through the dryer. This is extra. Wow. But if you notice in here, we have. I saw that, uh, towels that were. Yeah, we up. stack the towels so that it's easy access when we are filling the rooms. Or if they're coming out the sauna, they can just grab a towel when they need one. And how many of these towel stands around do you have? Just two in just this two main area. In this area. Yes. Okay. So um, we try to control stuff. it because this area you and use the most. Nice towels too. Yeah, you but know. then laundry. Yeah. So we have actually been looking at controlling how many towels because you saw how many towels. So now I'm looking at the cost per service. So I'm like, okay, if we're using four towels, the cost of this and product, can we use two? Two. And you don't use anything disposable. Um. No, we we don't. Um, it costs more a little bit if you. I mean, we, but look what we have. We yeah. have a big. We have a big department. You do to to, to hold it. Yeah. Now, if you don't, if you're in a smaller space and you don't have the staff, yeah. You or even laundry on site oh. because if this was contracted out for a laundry company. Yeah. Oh, it was it was expensive. We used to do that, and it was way expensive. Oh it was very gosh. expensive. Yeah. It was worth me buying ten thousand dollars of those machines. Then. 
than Ooh, a laundry. Y'all hear that? Good lord. But it, it saved. Absolutely. It was a big price saver. But and it was a big ticket investment for that year too. So yeah. Oh yeah. Yes, yes, yes. 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 So right off. Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. So. Here's some um before and afters from the wrap. I don't know if it's too little low light for this. Is it too low? Right. Let's go right here. There we go, baby. With doing the programs from our supplements to wraps. Oh, so that was all combination. Mm -hmm. Combination wow. of a healthy diet, exercise. And that's you. Yeah, that's me. I lost a total of 52 pounds. Oh my gosh, yeah. Tiffany. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Brie and lost. Brie. Uh -huh, Brie lost. And um, this was a guest who, um, come, she had come from Afghanistan. She was moving home and she lost. She did amazing. Wow. wow. We could just keep this here, but we try to let people know that this isn't just this about is the body gorgeous, rest. The it's a total, it's it's everything. What you put in your mouth, how much rest you're getting, um, all makes like, up. I get on the scale when you're on camera. Because yeah. <laughs> I don't do scales, so. Now this one makes us the body wrap shop. Um, because the way our setup is, a lot of times people want to offer wraps, but they really. So they're going to stand for an hour. No, no, no. No. They're only in there for about 10 to 15 minutes. So this is putting the wraps on? Yes. And then where do they go after then the wraps are Depending on, on what they're, they're going to either go in the blanket oh. or they're going to go over here. Oh. And then they come in here and they recline back. I love this room. Yes, and I so do. they can watch a movie. They can um, get their teeth whitened. So how long are they going to be in here? They're in here an hour. An hour. So it's 10 minutes to get the wrap on. About 12 minutes. 12 minutes and then an hour sitting. Mm -hmm. And how long does it take to unwrap? Mm, like a couple minutes. And then what do they do after that? They go uh, home? Uh, yes, I make them go to the restroom. Okay. And then we rewrap. I mean, we uh, remeasure. We oh, measure before. We measure before, after. before measure. Oh, I gotcha, I gotcha, I gotcha, I gotcha. This is and beautiful. And over here in the corner, that's where we do the um, ion foot detox. Oh, so we do yeah, that. the bands, right? You put your feet in. Yes, I think I saw. Isn't that when I saw you at the Dallas show? You were talking. They were sitting with these people. Was it Bree or you that were trying to talk to them about? Because you know they always talk about the shows. Oh, okay. Well, we've had these since I was in Florida when I had oh. the location in Florida. But um, I had tore my ACL when I was in college, and when they introduced this to us as a as a company for the body wraps, that machine actually helped me. Cause I used my I used to my knee would swell, and when I started doing this, it would I didn't have to do, have it the fluids pulled off. Oh wow! So that saved me. And then um, two years ago, it's almost yeah, it's almost been two years. I was diagnosed with lupus, and so this actually helps me with reducing pain, inflammation. So I really am an advocate for the foot detox and only one brand, which is the uh, the AMD. Yeah. So go ahead and get close. A major on that. difference. Right. Okay. A right. major difference. They're by far the best um, makers for ion foot. Detox. And that's all you don't deal with nobody nope. else. Nope. Nope. They. I can call and they answer my question down from the secretary to the president of the company. I've wow. had those machines for ten years. Wow. So if you were ever gonna ten years. Because mm -hmm. I started I'm, in Florida. That's right. I've been here eight. And you've had the same ones for ten same years. Same here. Same same years. Now how much does it cost? Now tell me, average. If someone came in and they got the foot and they got the body and the whatever, do you have packages that you stack? I do on? have packages. Um, but we, you know, we have different ways that we do. Well, things. we'll talk about that when we come yeah. out. We ain't done. Yeah. Come on, we ain't done. <laughs> but I mean, it, it could be about two hundred dollars a day if somebody came for in for one person. Mm -hmm. That's good. That's how I like it. Yeah. Yes. You know what I mean? I like it like that. Yeah. So it's all uh, about enhancements. And you have one, two, three, five. four, five. Mm -hmm. About five wrap spaces. My goodness. Yeah. This is wonderful. Yes? Come on. We're going to go and we're going to chat. Where you want to chat? Right here in the in the open space? Is it lighter? Mm -hmm. You want to do it lighter? Yeah, it's a little lighter in here. Come on. We're going to go to the front on this side. This is you. Mm -hmm. Yes. Actually, baby, why don't you get right there and we can chat, chat. <laughs> and it'll be good lighting. I love this room, too. <laughs> so we're back at the front on the other side. Yes? Okay. Uh-oh. You okay, baby? Are can we you get us enough? both? We're not close enough? Okay. Yeah? Okay. All right. Yeah. Okay. So go ahead and tell. You said it's like a $200 day. Yeah. Well, the Fuddy Tops have run $49. Okay. By itself. By itself. But we do run specials. You buy more than one, 
we give you a break. Mm. But one se- because one session, it's, it's going to do okay. But multiple sessions, 14 sessions, you know, we give you a break on them. You do them, you spread them out about three days apart if you really want to do a full detox. But they buy them in sections of three. Hmm. Most of them do. Um, but it helps with so many different things. You do a lot of body stuff here. Yes. Your really focus is body. Internal health, wellness. Um, even when someone comes in about weight loss, we first thing we ask, how are you sleeping? How's your bowel movement? Mm-hmm. What's going on with you? Most of the time they're not sleeping. We start them with a massage. We start them in the blanket. We start lymphatic drainage. We do not go in, oh, you need this many body wraps. If they have a lymphatic issue, we do lymphatic massage if we need to. Like we look at the whole body. It's not just, oh, because I can get 149 out of them for a body wrap. Your body wraps are 149? Yes. And that's for one? Uh, And then the infrared blanket treatment is 189. (laughs) Wow. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But the results that you actually get, they rave about it. If they're if they're listening to the consultation, uh, they're going to see results. But a lot of times, the result starts internally. Like they know that notice they're sleeping better, their concentration better, their mood is better, skin starts to get better, mm-hmm. and then everything. Once the body starts to eliminate, then they start to see the inches. The weight. So that makes sense. So if you're working internally and then, you know, because that's a big thing with people when they go on detox. Oh, my face went bad or I started breaking out. Mm-hmm. But you have help for that too. Exactly. So you're really working totality, not just, not just you know, on the problem. And, and, when they come and, in, we do skincare. What's your primary concern? What's the secondary? Let's talk about that. How do, let's start here. Let's go to the next step. What are you eating? How are you sleeping? All that affects I'm looking at the hair. Is it brittle? Is it scalp dry? I'm looking at their hands. I'm I'm doing a whole assessment even when I'm doing skincare. Wow. Because it gives me the whole picture. What jobs are they doing? In Oklahoma, we have seasonal change. Right now, we have allergies. Crazy. Everybody's skin is bad. Because it's all all in the skin. Well, we have to address that too. So you have to educate them to know that when the season change, guess what? The skin's gonna change. Absolutely. Um, the body's gonna change. So it's all about educating them so that when they know something changes, they say, oh, she told me. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna call her. So how long, how, how long typically with your clients here, because you do body, what is your retention? Retention for our repeat guests is pretty high. It's about 80 something percent. Because <sighs> we, once we bring them in, we do body wraps, now we're doing skincare. They know when they need a detox, they can come back. Wow. Our, our referrals is huge for us because that's they refer. That's our largest number in terms of like advertising is word of mouth. Now, do you have like a referral program? Do you, you don't do you do nothing. I don't do anything, but I want to. <laughs> I want to because now I want to reward them because yeah. I'm like, wow, if they're doing it already, what right. else can I do? So I did ha- have a meeting with a marketer. Um, Actually, she's a guest. Okay. She lives in Texas. And it's great because she believes in my service. She understands my service. So now she can market it. Right. So that's, that's great. That's so if great. you have, you you know, if you are using a marketer, they really need to understand your, your and experience. Exper- but they got to like it. They got to yeah. understand. That's the difference. Yeah. And so the great thing is that she we have something that she likes. Yeah. Wow. So now, you did client appreciation. Do you do client appreciation? I do. Um, in October, um, I do one. It's right before our you know anniversary. So those of you guys who've been in my mastermind classes, we always talk about client appreciation days in the slower times. I always suggest yes. September and October is a great time because it gives you a nice spike before gift certificates. Yes. So um, this, during that time when we do that, I like to invite. Like when um, Pam came in, it was during June, but that was her availability. But usually when we invite people out for an event, it's about 150 to 200 people will show up. Wow. And this is just one day? Do you do one One day. day. But we have set up um, each event. We've always had demos. We have stations set up for information, product information. So we make sure that even when you're doing open house, it's fun. You have food. You have drinks. Those are great. But if if you don't really have an opportunity to promote your product, offer some sales, you want to make money at those events. So if you are partnering with vendors, reach out to them and see what they can give you, giveaways. Um, if you make a bulk order, is there any discount? Things like that really does help. 
Um, and that's what I've been talking about, like how you spend your money. And I know you're, uh, <laughs> when I met, we talked about straight yes. up yeah. how much you spend. Yeah. But it wasn't really about how much you spend. You buy specifically in a certain way. Yes. Um, I've had to change a little bit because the economy here is a little different, but I did. I love building relationships with the brand. My, when we bought product from you, mm -hmm. it was important that I build a relationship with mm -hmm. you. Um, all of my vendors I tend to have, if, if it's the rep, I want a partnership. I don't want just, I bought product from you. I want, to, I want you to know my name. I want to know your name. I, to me, it's a partnership, and that's important. So who doesn't want to partner with me, then I'm probably not going to use the product. You know, because I need to know. I want you to share your information. I want to know the training. Is something changing? Because I want you to know that I'm investing just as you're investing information to me. That's so that's a huge. Point. That's yeah. a huge, huge point. And when I met Tiffany and she, I met her at the show. You know, she was like, "Oh no, I'm not looking at one or two. Where, where is the discounts? <laughs> Tell where's me the bulk order? Yeah, where's the bulk orders? I want the bulk orders. How can I get it free too? Yeah. You know." And I said, "See, now I want to talk to you. <laughs> See, now we talk in the same language. Yeah. You know, the ones and twos of y'all are great, but it's the ones who understand yeah, because she's not trying to do it over a period of time. Mm -hmm. This owner here has a lot of overhead. Yes, yeah. So she has to spend with purpose. Yeah. And I've been talking probably the last two or three periscopes about, you know, where's your money going? How do you look at your money? When you pay yourself? How are you doing all these things? And a lot of people just don't know. You know, yeah. and you, when I met you, you were like, uh uh, I, I do only do bulk and I only try to get it when it's free. Right. <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, I, it is, it's important because mm -hmm. at that time, if I could, because with body wraps, it's seasonal. Mm, so I, I had, yes. Yeah, so the first quarter of the year, going into the last month, going, into my second quarter, that's my peak. So you need to know when your bell curve happens. Yes. So then it peaks down, so I know that I purchase more of my bulk during that time to carry me from the first quarter and the fourth quarter because it's gonna help me out. So it's better to get bigger bulk during that time because I had the money mm -hmm. so that I could take the other money but to put it in uh, reserve. Mm -hmm. You know, something might break, you gotta replace it. Hello? Yeah, so you wanna buy, but be smart when you buy because there was times that I did buy in bulk and I was like, oh, that's on sale. Let me get that. And you, then you, you're left over with stuff you're not using and products like now we just eliminate a lot of services off our menu, products that we weren't really using. We were keeping in stock. No, I got rid of, I started leaning out a lot of things that were irrelevant. Trying to come up with all these fancy names for all this fancy stuff to put on the menu. Just cut it. It's just, it's a waste of time. The, the customer gets lost in it. We did an evaluation on the services. How many are we doing? If we were doing under eight, cut. Wow. No more. It's a waste of product, waste of room. What can we do? Can we double this? What's working? Let's see what's working and mm -hmm. do it more. Yeah. See, everything that I talked about with you guys, that's how you have to do in business. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm not making it up, but I know Tiffany is busy, so we're going to do question and answers. Yay. We're going to go ahead and open up. If you have any questions for Miss Tiffany, this is the time to go ahead and launch them. <laughs> like, like Rudy's looking off. Do we have any questions, baby? Not yet? Hearts. We have lots Yay! of hearts. Yay! Thank you for the hearts. So I am in Oklahoma. We're trying to figure out what I can do here. Yes. Yes. You know, besides experience it. <laughs> but uh, we're in talks about smooth skin supply and here and estheticians and classes and, yes. you know, what I do best. So. I think they all ask the questions while we were walking around. Oh, while we were walking around? They don't have no questions for Tiffany? Not for me. Well, fine. Then we'll keep going. So you have how many on staff here? Right now. We and have, that was the question. How many on staff? Oh, <laughs> see, we have a total of five now. We yeah, started five. to downsize um, due to in Oklahoma, everybody's experiencing the gas issue, um, mm. oil and gas. So we are experiencing um, a lot of layoffs. Mm. You know, if anybody's in the stock market, you probably had to shift some of your old um, uh, stocks. Yes. Yeah. So I'm in the heart of it. Um, two of the major companies that controlled a lot of that are right near me, but then mm. so many distance. So, so the layoffs. So a lot, yeah, seven to a thousand. So we have a, two questions. Yes. Spray tan. No. And the question is, did you start off with the space or did you grow into it? I started off in the space and I did grow into it. Um, Whoa. Yeah. So you start off with 5,000 square feet. I mean, no, I'm sorry, no. I started <laughs> off with 2,500 and I grew into the 5,000, I'm sorry. So you had half. So you yeah. had not this side. I had this side first. Oh, you did have this yes. side. In 2013, you expanded. I expanded next door. next door. How do you advertise and get clients? 
Um, I, when I first opened, when I first moved into this market, probably the first three years, I probably dumped about $30,000 in advertising. In 2013, I stopped. All that paid off. Oh, so it took a year or it took two. Several years, but it paid off. I built, there's a t difference between marketing and branding. Yes, yes. So I built my name. So I had a PR company, did a lot of TV. Oh, wow. Interviews. I had a lot of the, um, you know, interview, the, you know, people go out the news. Yeah, 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 yeah. I offer services to them, go on the shows. Wow. So I had a lot of coverage. Um, I got involved in a lot of um, chambers. Um, I, I build relationships with people, business to business, so then I become the referral. Mm -hmm. I also, places that I shop and spend money, they refer. Mm -hmm. So make sure you go spend money places, you can build those relationships. Mm -hmm. um, and I do radio, I've done radio, I've, I've done it all pretty much. I mean, I've done Groupon, unfortunately, mm -hmm. that you know lowered my um, volume per ticket, um, and we built it back up. But I, I pretty much have done everything. Now, um, I had a radio show about skin and wellness, so I partnered with uh, one of the stations, and they didn't really have anything on health it was an urban station. Mm. They didn't have anything talked about, you know, wellness, skincare, any of that. So one of the ladies, her show runs between noon and two. So it's like kind of lunchtime. That's a good time. So I go on for 45 minutes and we talk about skincare and wellness. How often you do this? Twice a month. Wow. So I built the relationship with the radio station, which I didn't feel that I probably had an audience. Mm. And I said, well, let me just bring in. Let's see what happens. I didn't do a bunch of deals. I did, it was just body wrap salon, come see us, we offer blah, 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 blah. And then I did the show. Now I go places, people like, oh, you have the radio show. Or wow. I heard you. So a guy was in Walmart. He was tell, talking to me about some MLM company. I was like, no, I'm not interested. <laughs> I give him my car. And he was like, you got a business. I can offer blah, blah, blah. And literally, I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll go down the aisle. He comes running down the aisle. He was like, that's you. You told me to go get skincare, um, uh, sunscreen. He went out and bought sunscreen because wow. I was recommending for men who shave and they need SPF. Yes. And he was like, "Oh my gosh, yeah, I love your, sh I love listening to you." Wow. And this, he was like in his like late fifties. Wow. Yeah. So we, so yeah, so I started that back up next month. I took a little break, but mm -hmm. I'm starting. And he hadn't heard it in a while, and he still remembered. So it's all about building relationships. Um, I know right now everybody's looking because there's a lot of digital marketing things. Yeah. There's a lot of you know, I really, at this point, I, I'll tell you, it's really tough because there's so much, you know, should you do Facebook ads, should you do campaigns? Um, we have a database of over 9,000 people. My goal right now, what we're trying to do is dive back into that database, find the people that loved us, yep. and now go back in a while, then yep. again with new stuff. Yep. Um, it, you know, customer engagement, the people that's already bought from you, offer the referral programs. Yes. So I, I, I'm looking myself. You know, but you have a lot to work with. I mean, most of them don't have 9,000 customers that they have walked through yeah. to have that database. I mean, you have a lot that yeah. you can work with and offer. Yeah. Go ahead. And then how many beauty schools are around in the area? There are six. There are six. And some of them are tech schools. So you have, of course, the high school part. Oh, okay. okay. Um, and then you also have the evening, which is more of adult for classes. So we have six. But, I mean, you know, the pools can be good or bad. Yeah. It, you know. And you, Bree has been with you for a long time. Yes. Bree started up with me with marketing. Oh, she did. She started with me with marketing, yeah. So she's kind of been my eyes and ears, mm -hmm. trainer, mm -hmm. you know, things mm -hmm. like that. Yeah. Wow. No other questions? No? This has been an amazing experience. I mean, you said I'm so it. I'm happy. When you met, when you met me, you said it, and I was like, oh, okay. Yeah. You know, yeah. not I never out. thought we'd be right here. I never thought that I would be sitting right here having a conversation with you, mm -hmm. especially after everything. Yes. You know, you and I. Yes. yes. You know what I'm yep. saying? I do. <laughs> and then That's I told, personal stuff. Right? Personal <laughs> stuff. And I told Rudy, I said, I, we're driving. We might as well go up to Oklahoma. Let's, yeah. let's go visit. I really want to see what we can do and if we can do yeah. something here. And I think we can. Yeah. I mean, that's where yeah. I'm like. But this has been an amazing experience. So if you're in Oklahoma, yes. if you're in Oklahoma City, please come by and see Miss Tiffany. Yes, the mm -hmm. Body Wraps Salon. I hope we'll be back. We will be back. There's one, one more question about yeah. what do you think is the most efficient 
or effective way of advertising for you? Is there one? I don't, it just really, it, it's not, I, you know what? Engaging with your guests. I'll say every person that walks through the front door, look at it as a repeat or future customer. Never let them walk out the door without rebooking or giving them additional information. Number one would be education. Absolutely. Because that person walked in your door, that can be a $10,000 client a year. You should be looking at your big spender reports. If you don't have a system for your reports, you need to know what how they're spending. Use? We use MindBody. Okay. But you really need to, every person that walks to you, through my door, I appreciate every single one of them. I mean, like, I'm like, thank you, because they didn't have to walk in the door. Absolutely. So, in terms of effective advertising, um, I, I recently did some YP, mm -hmm. Yellow Pages, mm -hmm. um, that immediately got me some, you know, guests coming through the door, and we were able to track it. They also have a voice recorder, so when you, when someone calls, um, and they call the number from, like, Googling your information, when they it records the phone call so you can also use that for customer service um, for your front desk person so that was good I can't say I did get a lot of um, hits from that in the most recent so I mean that's wow. Facebook Facebook um, we're not huge on Instagram but we're gonna start trying to Weren't do you doing something ads. on YouTube too? Didn't you have you were recording? We just had some recordings that we've done on YouTube, okay. but not I mean nothing that we pushed. Okay. Um, a lot of us our stuff was like a lot of local things. But okay. Radio. Um but it's so expensive. Yeah. So I mean those were one of the things that we did you know, that I did notice if somebody wanted to. But I what I'm noticing is that the more content you put out um, I want to get into more videos. Mm -hmm. So if you do offer videos, um, I believe that people like raw footage of your of mm -hmm. your spa. Like I posted this gold mask called the Midas Touch. It was not even a service, and it's like this little add-on ten-minute treatment. The machine was the microcurrent, mm. but of course it's not fancy. But this gold mask got all this attention. Wow! And so people start. I want the Midas Touch. I want the gold mask. And it was really just like a little add-on, but because it's shiny. So maybe like putting effective pictures on Facebook that looks fun or you, someone doing it and doing videos, I believe that really gets um, a lot of effective advertising or having the guests while you're there, you know, check in and share what you're mm -hmm. doing or film you doing the, the – because now we use our phones for everything. We do. So they want to take a picture like this guy came in, he wanted to detox. He said, I don't care what it is. He's like this big promoter in Oklahoma City. He's all in the club. He has a huge following. A lot of girls follow him. He came in and he took pictures in the rec room, in the blanket, and he posted, come to the bar, my girls, they take care of you. And I was like, oh my gosh. Immediately when he checked in, phone calls. Wow. What is he doing? Why? I want to do that. Yes. So somebody probably would think, you know, he wouldn't get, he wouldn't actually get, right. He, you wouldn't want to. He has a bunch of tattoos, that. yeah, 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 everything. But I know him; he's really cool. But he has a huge following. So when people have huge followings, if you get them in there and they start talking about you, that to me now that is good. Priceless, too. yeah, because our phones started ringing off the hook. Wow. So that I mean, that I will say that works. It. But you have multiple <laughs> methods of marketing. Yeah. You're not just doing one. Yeah. See, that's what's important. Some of us are only relying on Facebook. Or only relying on Instagram, but and you can't you do can. that. You can have your guests check in and share. Take a picture while they're in the wrap. Share that, and if you know that they have a huge following, check in when the, when they check in. Go to their Facebook page. See how many thank followers they coming. have. Thank you for coming. Yeah, Love thank to see you again. Yes. Responding to them. Don't just do set um, Facebook posts. You know they tell you set it and forget it. No, you don't. You need to engage. That's a good point. Yeah. No more questions. Okay, guys, I'm signing off. With Miss Tiffany. See you later. Bye.